and I've arrived. Yeah. Terminal 2, Heathrow. Listen, I had the suitcase packed beforehand, so that's why these are the only clothes that I got. I'm gonna go support Villarreal for the Europa League final. It's like Joe Bayer representing five all day long. Your house, Rio. Listen, I hope you don't win. Do I think you're gonna win? Most likely, let's be honest with you, United are a better team than them. But you never know, it's a one off game. It's a one off game, a little revenge for Arsenal. It could happen. But what's he doing? Why is he going to Poland? For Listen, yeah, I pre booked the ticket. Because I thought Arsenal were going to make it to the final. But obviously they didn't make it. But you know what? I stay committed. I'm still here. I don't even have a match ticket yet. But I'm determined to go support Villarreal. Making my way down. I have no idea what to expect, man. No idea. Wszystkie okna muszą być odsłonięte. Przypominamy, że w czasie lądowania laptopy i inne większe urządzenia elektroniczne muszą być odłączone od pokładowego źródła zasilania i zabezpieczone w bagażu podręcznym, kieszeni fotelu. After taking like two planes, listen, trips, goats, the whole lot, I finally landed in Gdansk. Ah, oh, it's been long. It has been absolutely long. But yeah, we're here now, so it's time to enjoy. Ho, ho, ho! And look at me! I'm lucky meeting Man United <laughs> fans! Nice Man United fans! Look at this guy! Man United oh fans! God, flex. Got... Hold on, hold on, Yo. hold on! Hold on a minute! Listen. Hold on a minute! So what? Yeah, we're outside you the gate. This the desk of... Did you... No! That's not supposed to be here! Listen, what I'm saying, what happened was, yeah. <laughs> Man, man back the wrong bags in it because obviously you got the the short haul travel i went back to the other to the other place and i had in my suitcase i didn't have a lot of clothes so all i had was this underneath so you it's wish, cool you it's wish cool. it was allowed in yeah there. i do wish it was there but you know what guys yeah listen let's just do it whilst we're here because i know you guys have just done a, a preview was mm, it a preview mm, little thing little thing little yeah so what do you reckon the score is going to be I'm, I'm hoping yeah i'm hoping yeah villarreal 2 Come yeah. on, my guy! You didn't know, you didn't know they good had an evening. Arsenal fan working for good United fans! Yeah. My G! Look at these good, good evening, good evening. Yeah. Good evening. I reckon it's going to be 3-1, yeah, uh, huh? No, no, I reckon no. it's going to be 3-1 United. A lot, a lot of people are saying you'll beat them. I reckon, I reckon you'll. I reckon you will. Now, you know what it is with this game is, yeah? yeah. I looked at them against you, mm -hmm. and you're right. They're not actually that good. Like, you lot are bad, don't get me wrong. But even, I still... <laughs> I thought, nah, you'll still beat them 1-0 at home. Like, I couldn't believe you didn't. That's you lot's bad. But we had chances as well. It's not like, it's not like we did it. Twice yeah, yeah, it was a bit still, yeah. It was a, it was a nuts one. So I look at it and think, we should be beating them. But we're in uncharted territories with Oli in this, like, you know what I mean? What you say, Oli's not good enough? No, no, he's good enough. He's good enough. It's his first final. This is this is his biggest game of his career. This is Oli's biggest game. This is his managerial career. This is his biggest game. So we got to get it right. Well, listen, like I'm saying, I do think United are going to win. I, I, unfortunately, You're I, trying to do I got myself. Psychology. I got myself. No, no. I got myself a ticket, and I have to sit in the Man United end. <laughs> how's that happen? <laughs> that would have been the end. That Arsenal occupied. Is that what you're saying? Like, how's that happen? And if you know anything about me, you know that I love me some boots. You know, you know. Sometimes we get lucky, and they send us a pair. Sometimes you just gotta go and get the new ones. You know what I mean? The Phantoms. I love this. Anywhere I can find a chance to kick ball, I'ma do it. You know what I mean? Watch out, because five, we're going to be playing some football soon as well. And we want you guys to get involved. It's game day. Listen, I put on my turtleneck, yeah? I put on my hat. And look, there's the stadium. Oh, I can't believe this. This is an absolute madness. Live football. Five. You know I'm here for you, baby. It doesn't matter what team you guys support. Joe is on the way. You and I take no, I can't tell you what I'm doing. Why are you sitting? Nah, I'm not drinking tonight. No, why? 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 You beat us no, in the semi final. He's okay. He's yeah. Okay. Yeah. He's okay. He's okay. Ah, Arsenal. No. Yes. Ah. That's my team. Arsenal. Ah, sorry, sorry, yeah. sorry, sorry, yeah. you sorry, sorry. You didn't sorry. recognize no. us, huh? Wait, wait. No, I, no, I, I you forgot. Do it. You you forgot. forgot. Yeah. Uh, they forget us. I... They do forget us. My, my favorite. No. But also, yeah. uh, my favorite. Uh, 
My Funny Player is... ¿Cómo se llama? Román Riquelme. Ah, ah, Riquelme. Lehman. Ah, And I think it was Justice. Ah. There's a lot of giggling here, as if it's a certified thing. Can I get your predictions, please? Four one. Mm, four one. Four, two, one. Two, one. Two, one. Two, one. Two, one. Two United. Yeah, United. Right, two one. That's a bit. Of a... Three yeah, one. No, I'm going two one. Start. Two, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Three, three one. one. Three, three one. one United. Yeah, I mean, when it actually comes down to it, Joel, you know what I mean? It's, it's a bit sticky. sticky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's a try. I don't blame you, bro. They they did a thing on us still. Hey, wait. Watch out for their wingers. They're tough. They're tough. Funny because I'm going to this game thanks to fabulous Alex Neil um, and his dad John. These guys, I've known him for many years. Yeah, supported them uh, at Old Trafford, they've supported me. There they are. There they are. Hello, my guys! How are we here? Thank you very much, man. Honestly, let's enjoy the game. a bit of a bad tackle. I think he's up on his feet. That was a bad challenge, boy. Man United free kick. Listen, United are looking better than Villarreal. I know it's not the most in-depth analysis available, but it's, it's the only thing I can say, man. Like, Villarreal don't really look like they're threatening too much. You know, I just need them to liven up for me, man. Come on, Villarreal. Come on. Oh, my God. Villarreal score. Cavani gives away the free kick, they whip it in, and it's a goal. I, even I can't believe it. The, Euro, the Europa League is mad. I told you, Villarreal, a tough team, you know. Villarreal are definitely finding their feet since they've scored comfortable. I have to say though, Paul Pogba's looked very good today in my opinion. He's got a lot of loose ends. But overall, Villarreal are really growing into the game. United score! I was trying to get my food, but they've got the goal. It's the deal of like Cavani. I told you he was causing problems. Great goal. you got to respect it, man. 1-1, one, one, game on for United. Was a, that was a good chance for Marcus Rashford, I'm not going to lie. United should be leading. I'll tell you what, they're in control. I do expect them to get another goal, but Rashi should have finished that, to be really honest. And you know where it is. Full time, 1-1. One, one. It's going to extra time. Man United fans. What's going on, people? Man United fans. You know what? I still, I still, I still believe you'll win the game, if I'm honest. We're just making it harder than what I would have assumed. Or maybe Villarreal are a better team than we all thought. I don't know. But yeah, it's raining now. You can see some of the players are getting a little bit tired. This is where you want to see the greatness from players like Paul Pogba. Bruno to unlock the defence. It could take one pass. That's it. 
Because if it goes down to penalty shootouts, it could be anyone's game. Villarreal's positioning is very, very unique when uh, Man United are taking a goal kick. Like, David De Gea doesn't know what to do. He doesn't know whether to go long, whether to go short. He keeps playing it to Lindelof. You can tell that he's struggling here. The way they've closed them down on goal kicks has been really good. And I don't know, I feel like United are running out of ideas. Again, they've been attacking. Like, Moreno's had a shot. Um, you know what? If, if Villarreal had better players, Man United would have been in trouble at the moment. I can't lie. They've got to be doing better than that, man. Look, David De Gea at the goal kick again. What is he going to do? I don't even think he knows. Rashford's off for Fred, which I'm a bit confused about because you would, you would need... Oh, no, 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 no. Rashford's still on. It's Greenwood that's off. Greenwood's off for Fred. I really don't know about that because you're going to need him for pens if it goes that far. But I do feel like they need someone else in the hole because, like I said, they, they don't really have a lot of options. Man. Eric Bailly being rash again near his area. He needs to be careful, man. Eric Bailly being rash again near his area. How many times have we heard that during the course of the season? United already conceded from a set piece earlier on in the game. You've got to be smarter than that, man. You've got to be smarter than that. Shoot out. Villarreal draw first blood. Listen, <laughs> this is something else right now. Something else. Not on the OG one now. Hey, listen, when you call on him, he does the job, innit? Villarreal with a pen. Oh, slotted in. Coolly enough. Tellers with the pen. Is he cultured? He sure is. That's a good finish. I think David De Gea should have saved that one. The pen. Bruno with the pen. Bruno gets it in. Oh my days. Madness. James with the pen. Oi! Why is that you, James? Why would you take it off? <laughs> Man like Luke Shaw. Man like Luke Shaw. got lucky if luck's gonna change yeah it's gonna be because of that for united because boy oh boy the goalkeeper should have saved that one and the real with a pen what the heck now that was a finish lindelof's next a united fans close your eyes close your eyes Just close it dig in the start oh lindelof struck in the world Oi. That was a good, good penalty by the Villarreal goalkeeper. I still do think that De Gea should have been doing better in the shootout though, but I think I think he's kind of letting that down a little bit. It's De Gea's turn now. Let's see what happens. David De Gea with the pen. Celebrations are going mad inside. Celebrations are on an all-time high for Villarreal. I told you, man, this is Unai's cup. As mad as it is, I did want to see some of the Man United players do well. Especially going into the Euros, you want them to have great confidence. So it is a shame. But yeah, man, listen, hopefully you've enjoyed the vlogs. We're going to be doing quite a lot during the course of the Euros. So make sure you stay tuned. Joe Bayer, make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe. And we'll see you soon. Vibe with five. Coming soon as well. Peace.